What's up and welcome to another video. I'm 7Beats and today we're going to create an original Afro beat for beginners. First, I'm going to adjust the BPM to 100 and I'm going to start off with Omnisphere. So I'm going to use this keys for reflection preset and disable the cave water. So I'm using the keys. I'm going to create something dark. So we'll start off with this D sharp. Just duplicate it again to G. So I've played around with the melody for a while and right now it sounds like this. Edit this A sharp. I think it's really fire. And this chorus is also created in D sharp minor. So right now I'm going to add a focus sample. So I'm going to use arcade. So I'm going to use this done with you preset. I'm going to set the key to G to D sharp minor and just play around with the sample. So I'm gonna change the pitch of the sample. I'm using this one edit and turn up 12 semitones. So removing the low and high frequencies. All right, now adding some reverb. So right now I'm going to add another scene from Purity. So I'm searching for a pan flute. Woodwinds. This one. And I'm starting off with this one. Maybe turn up one octave. That's pretty awesome. So duplicate it. And right now just add another one. So I'm going to use purity again. So a wood wine. This ocarina, this one. And we're just gonna add another melody from scratch on top of this one. So for example, just listen to it and then we'll come up with a melody. We're just using the root notes. And Jama used this A. Maybe just inverse. So right now I'm going to add some more drums. So I'm going to use my African sound pack volume one. First I'm going to pick a random kick. This one. And I'm going to pick a rim shot. So I'm going to choose short one. Tweaked. This one. I'm also going to pick some percussion. So toms. Just pick a conga. So I'm just going to drag this in. I'm going to 26. Just picking some random ones, so 78, 71. And this low one. So I've also dragged in shaker loop one, most commonly used shaker loop. So right now we want to create a triplet pattern like this. Just duplicate it like this. Then we're going to add the kick. So this is our kick pattern. Right now we're gonna add the conga. Like this. Then we're gonna add the djembe. I'm gonna add the 
det er slow jamme. Maybe just play around with the pitch of jam 71. So right now I'm going to add a bass line. So I'm going to create this one from scratch using the three usk. Throwing this one down to zero semitones and just add a little bit of high frequencies. Pitch it up to 12, which is by default, by the way. So this is our bass line. I'm going to remove that annoying clicky sound. Just a little bit of attack. And then just create a square. Just a little bit of release. That's pretty awesome. So I think it's still missing some high frequency, so I'm going to add some symbols. I'm just going to add an open head. So I've just dragged in this one. So this is the pattern which I've created, and it's just following the rim shot. Maybe turn it down. Maybe add some more release. Add a little bit of swing around 20%. That typical clip, this one. Drag it in. I'm gonna pitch it down. This. So right now I'm gonna create just a simple arrangement. So right now I've created an arrangement which will last for around one minute. I've added this drum loop, this one. from my Afro Future sample pack. All right now, just have a listen. For us, the vocal sample and the keys. so much for watching this tutorial make sure to leave it a thumbs up so other people will see this tutorial also make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to stay tuned for more videos and see you guys in one of my next tutorials